This is really the only exercise that you will ever need for side pressure. So guys, today I'm going to be showing you the best, cleanest and most effective exercise to train your side pressure. This exercise will focus only on your muscles and to be specific, your tricep muscle, which is solely responsible for the strength of your side pressure at the very beginning of the match. Even though some other muscles might get activated during this exercise, the tricep is going to do most of the heavy lifting and the power that you have from your side pressure mostly comes from your tricep. So how do you actually do this exercise and how do you set it up? I do it from a table pulley like this one and uh, I haven't really found any alternative exercises to this. So if you don't have a pulley like me, uh, I would encourage you to try and find something similar. I set the pulley height to be almost the same as my arm and then I take just a regular judo belt and I attach it like this. Now how to actually get set up for, for this exercise. You want to put the judo belt in your arm so it's like this. So it, you don't have any pressure going through your wrist. So it's all on your tricep and on, on your side pressure. Then you want to put your elbow in the middle of your body. Set the elbow down and you want to square off like you were in an actual match. And then you want to hold without letting your hand fall and align with your shoulder and lift the weight like so. If your arm is uh, going off the pad, that is fine. I really didn't find that uh, to be a problem, but this is basically how the exercise looks like. You constantly keep your arm in the middle of your body. You don't let it fall outside and doing it like this will strengthen your tricep and the pressure that you can actually uh, make from the very start of the match when you go into any move really into a top row, into a hook or a press. As long as that hand stays in the middle and doesn't go anywhere. There is no movement of the arm like this. You can uh, just tense up uh, your tricep if you want before lifting the weight and that does help a little bit. But most of the time you're just staying squared up and you're simulating like you're just holding someone, let's say in the middle of the table with your side pressure or your tricep. One more thing to keep in mind when you're doing this exercise is to keep your arm high with your rising as well. High, you don't wanna go low like this as this is actually the optimal position that you most of the time want to be in the match. So practicing it from here will kind of get you some muscle memory as well. So you will actually be able to uh, utilize the side pressure uh, much more easily during the match. So like this, instead of this. Here in the middle of my body and lifting. So guys, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you learned something new. Uh, this was just a short little video to showcase the new exercise that I've started using recently to strengthen my side pressure. And I honestly think this is the only exercise that you need. Uh, you might see a lot of pullers uh, like Casimir and uh, uh, Sandris maybe even uh, do a lot of side pressure exercises with the rotating handle. And I really don't like that as it puts a lot of stress on your shoulder and on your uh, wrist. And that kind of limits the amount of weight that you can lift with your actual side pressure. And I think this is a great alternative to that uh, where it's super clean and only your side pressure works and there's no shoulder shoulder involvement your arm does, doesn't go uh, way off like here and you don't lift with your tendons or your bones it's only mu a pure muscle work so I would highly, highly recommend you to try this out and let me know in the comments what you think of the exercise and if you have any questions or suggestions leave them also in the comments below I'll be reading them all and I will see you all in the next video bye